we are back at Chubby's because I officially feel like this is our identity and place now. Danielle is here this time, so it's even better. And guess what? I don't have to wake up at the back of dawn tomorrow. Day one slash two, because we got here last night in Toronto. We are on our way right now to see our freaking end cap. And if you don't know what an end cap is, it is a really big deal. Basically, it's our own dedicated section at Sephora. Like we have a whole three foot display, multiple shelves situation. Our concealers are there. And it's the first time I'm seeing even our S mineral SPF is there. So it's just, this is like a really, Cool moment. Day in Toronto, we are going to a Sephora store to do our first ever meetup in Canada with um, people from the Live Tinted community coming to meet me, I guess, and see the products. moment this is Monal and she's one of the founders of Asante Cosmetics and when I worked at Birchbox I met them because they were doing programs with them and I remember thinking how cool it is that there's a brown girl who has a beauty brand and is it working with Birchbox no and now we both have them it's yeah. crazy and, and you're here been following you and I'm just like in awe of everything you well I felt Probably. the same way about you. I know, but you've taken it to a next level. No. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you guys. We just got done doing the meet and greet at Sephora in Toronto and man. I have to say we've done this in like four cities now, five cities now. Like a tour for our concealer and Toronto hands down has to be my favorite. People told me they changed their flights to be here today. Um, they were shaking just like out of excitement and joy and um, people were crying. They brought me letters, they brought me gifts. I guess I just want to like remember it forever. I mean you only get one time to see your end cap, a full freaking end cap for your brand. You only get that once, that feeling, that moment. It's one thing to get into Sephora, but the thing people don't talk about is it's harder to stay in Sephora. So for you guys to show up and show out and say, of course you're gonna support the brand, I mean, I'm forever grateful. So anyways, next up, I'm going to India in a week. I have been sleeping all day. It is now 6.30 p.m. So it's been 12 hours later and I've been sleeping all day and I do feel semi-humid. Now Mira is back. Yay! Um, and we are doing fittings for um, the upcoming events. Thank God she's here. Shout out to her because of her, I could come with just a carry-on. There's a lot of stuff here. Some fun jewels. The shower. So many options, not enough events. I have no idea what I'm gonna wear, but that was exhausting, but also fun. It's 
so different yeah. for me. I love it. Mira has pushed me out of my comfort zone. I've never worn this designer. judge last year and Divya was our, our grow a winner. As so many of us here probably had no contacts into the beauty industry, right? Like growing up in Texas, everyone in my family was becoming doctors. And in my brain, living in New York City and working for a massive beauty brand was the ultimate dream. But I had no clue how I was going to get there because how does someone from Texas get to New York? going to go to bed because <laughs> we're getting up at 6 a.m. Everyone's like, what's going on tonight? Where are you going? I'm like, what are you talking about? I haven't slept. I woke up at three or four and I haven't slept since. So like, I just need to pass out. We are doing the judging this morning. This is just my casual judging outfit and glam. <laughs> So this morning is a breakfast, and then I think it's like four hours of judging, hearing all the different pitches. I met some of the people yesterday. They were so sweet and so kind. on women uh, with skin of our color. It's all westernized research, which is then put into product making or whatever. And I feel they underestimate the power of the beauty revolution that's happening here. I think the that you are Never give up. With the, wig. the community winner in the grow category is Beauty Wise. And the community winner in the Imagine category is Hava. can't articulate sentences but it was so worth it for like 50 different ways like the joy of like just the Indian beauty market growing reconnect or connecting with my friends meeting new friends Gaurav Gupta invited me to his Paris show who casually dressed Beyonce for the Renaissance tour like I'm delusional but it was worth it and I'm so excited I feel like I'm this much closer to launching this brand in the motherland and I'm just inspired. And now I'm gonna go back to LA for two days and then I will see y'all in New York. And we're now in New York City. Hello, Maha and I just arrived and I'm here doing a partnership with the brand Naturalizer. I'm doing, um, we created a shoe together. It's really cool and I'm here for the actual shoot. It's coming out next spring. Tomorrow is we're doing um, a styling session for the shoot that's on Wednesday, and that'll be the trip. And then guess what? I'm in LA for a solid few weeks. Yay! I am doing my first ever shoe collab with the brand Naturalizer, the most comfortable freaking shoes in the planet, and the cutest because we designed this together. And today I am here for my fitting. The actual shoot is tomorrow. It's gonna be so fun. It's gonna be 
be a good day. I feel um, exhausted. <laughs> but I'm waking up. Val's here, Daniel's here. It's gonna be a good day. Is a wrap that shoot was so freaking cool I can't believe I have a shoe that's insane and it was also straight up production goals I cannot wait to one day be able to do shoots like that for lip tinted but shout out to naturalizer for you know partnering with me and wanting to partner with me that was such a cool experience and now I am tired y'all I was supposed to go to Chicago by the way from here because there's a big meeting with Ulta tomorrow and I said I'm zooming in because that's called boundaries mm -hmm. but I hope y'all liked the Deepika world tour I tried to document as much as possible but you know I don't even have a voice at this point but yeah until next time safe travels to me <laughs> see y'all next time bye